Hi everyone, happy Sunday. Today I am super excited to be doing a fall haul for you guys. I know last week was a little bit serious, but I thought that this week I would bring it back, lighten it up, and have some fun with some uh, fall and Halloween planner goodies. So super excited to share this with you because this is my favorite season. Um, before we get started, I also just wanted to say thank you to you guys so much for all your support. I just realized I'm almost at 100 subscribers. That is incredible. And the outpouring of love and kind words that I received after last week's videos was extremely touching as well. So thank you so much. You guys are awesome. And um, if you are new to my channel, don't forget to hit the subscribe button as well. And like this video and give it a thumbs up if you enjoy it. Let's get started. All right, so today is also kind of exciting because my husband actually took the kids outside of the house. So for the first time, I don't have to worry about anybody running in while I'm filming and have to restart the video a million times. Um, Harley is actually sleeping downstairs, so hopefully she's not barking either. Um, so really just have my own mistakes to worry about today. So, <laughs> but I, I can, I can deal with that. So the first shop that I'm going to be showing you is from mix -A cat I absolutely adore her stickers. Um, I always tell her I'm, I always used to be a dog person, um, but she has definitely converted me. I adore her little cat stickers, you guys. She is the sweetest. And she is so talented. Look how cute. I'll show you guys more of these in a moment. This is a little card that she included. Um, I hope your purchase, I hope you love your purchase, sorry, as much as I enjoyed creating it. And thank you for having Mixy Cat in your planner world. Thank you for letting us be in yours because you make the cutest things. So, <laughs> that is adorable. All that matches having you in your planner world and then Mixy Cat's just sitting there chilling in space. Oh, everything she does with, with him or her um, is super cute. She actually just released a like horoscope series. So I'm dying to get my hands on my little Libra cat because I am a Libra. Uh, but they weren't released in time for this video. So I will definitely show those in my next haul. And these are the stickers that I got from her. Um, the first one that I got are these little camping stickers. We do like to go earlier in the season. We usually go once, one or two more times before uh, cottage season ends. And I just love these little, okay, little cats with the little marshmallows. My kids absolutely love doing that. They love going canoeing. Um, we don't actually sleep in a tent when we go to the cottage. We sleep in a building. I tried it once and it's just not for me. But I just thought it was cute regardless. The next one is Makes the Cat Enjoying My Favorite Fall Drink, which is the Pumpkin Spice Latte. So cute! And I like how there's like the two different versions, like when you get them, when you get it out from Starbucks or wherever. Or if you kind of just like make yourself like a fancy coffee at home, which we also do as well. We have like a little blender mixer thing and it makes like that whipped kind of milk on top, which I love, and we sprinkle some cinnamon on top. So definitely, definitely feeling these vibes here. Pumpkin Spice is life. This is a cute little freebie, which I love. I like the little birthday cake, sewing, which is super cute. Um, <laughs> it's just chilling here, looking super cute. I work in dental, so this one obviously speaks to me a lot. And then I guess this is just like, to mark like your shaving days, which is adorable and kind of a cute way to mark it on your planner if, if you keep track of that. Um, the next ones that I got are, oh, I lost you guys there for a second. That's well, okay. There you are. Okay, so are like these little Halloween costumes. So we have Superman, Spider-Man, Batman, Wonder Woman, and... Um, Captain America. Oh my god, I don't even know why that took me so long. I just totally blanked out. 
Um, so there's these, which we love. My kids are super into Batman and Spider-Man and Wonder Woman right now. Um, and so am I. I absolutely love Wonder Woman. I did get some of her um, products from the Wonder Woman launch and Erin Condren, which I will show you later on in this video. And there are some pictures of that as well on my Instagram. So I got these. And then there are some little... Halloween Mixie Cats, even though we are not going to be taking the kids for trick-or-treating this year and our city and all the cities around us have been reverting back a stage for COVID, unfortunately. So, but we are going to find some fun things to do with them still. And I still wanted to use some cute stickers to mark the occasion in my planner. We're thinking of even doing like maybe like a little scavenger hunt in the backyard with some candy kind of hidden around. We put up we put up our decorations this morning. And so just really important to try and keep, you know, as much normalcy as we can during this time, especially not just for us, but for the kids, because it's been so disruptive to them and, and they don't really understand what's going on. And they've been kind of sad. So keeping the spirit alive has definitely helped keep them happy and us too. The next sticker that I got is these adorable little cats in some Halloween mugs. So we've got and then like a little spider uh, mug, a pumpkin, Jack from Nightmare Before Christmas, little cute ghost saying boo, and Frankenstein. So cute. I actually have a huge mug collection. Um, and so I thought this was adorable and I actually got another one. <laughs> My husband's going to kill me, but I got one more. I couldn't resist for Halloween and actually I can show you guys that right now since we're kind of doing the mugs, but I didn't find anything quite as cute as these little mix cat mugs, but I did get this one and it says happy Halloween. There's a cute little cat and a bat and some pumpkins on it. So I thought that was really adorable. I do love coffee and tea. And how is there already hair on here from Harley? I literally just took this out of the bag like two seconds ago. But that is life with a dog, and I wouldn't have it any other way. So this is kind of my Halloween mug for this season that I was able to find, and I love. I'm going to start drinking out of that right away. Um, the other thing that I absolutely love are candles and pumpkins we actually went to the pumpkin patch last weekend with the kids and it was so much fun it's like one of the few things that are actually open right now um during covid so that was really awesome they were so excited um they didn't have any of the attractions or anything open but they had the farm part where you can just go pick a pumpkin and that was good enough for them and we came home and we carved it and so that was a cute day and this is the pumpkin spice uh scent which is awesome definitely my favorite and then this last one that i got is just kind of like fall themed jumping in the leaves which we've done this year holding a little candy corn which is adorable i love it like just in terms of like decoration it just reminds me of halloween but in terms of eating it we're not the biggest fans of it but it is still super cute and does remind me of fall so those are the stickers that I got from Mixy Cat. Okay, so the next shop that I got from is big shop, shocker, guys, uh, Glam Planner. <laughs> I I know, I know, I did like a huge Glam Planner haul with all my fall kits earlier in the season. Um, but it wasn't enough and then she released a bunch of other really beautiful stickers and so I went and got more. <laughs> it's a little bit of a problem but you can never have too many stickers especially for fall and I feel like Christmas is going to be the same way because they're my two favorite seasons of all time um, and so I just got a bunch of really cool little uh, like fall and Halloween stickers just to kind of add to some of my other spreads over the next few weeks and also use in um, my EC like petite planner. So I have the spreads that I'm going to be using in my Erin Condren um, planner that I did show you guys already last time. But I also like to decorate my um, 
my petite planner. So some of these stickers I'm going to be using like in these corners for um, the rest of the month. So they're just kind of like, they don't really belong to a kit, but they are going to just kind of help decorate this and, and celebrate Halloween that way. All right, so let's get into these guys here. So this is Lolly and Pop doing their pumpkins together. So Lolly is kind of going to carve the pumpkin and Pop is poking out of it. And there's this, there's like a different um, view right here. So there's one with her sitting down and then one with her standing up, which is super cute. For those of you guys who don't know, Lolly is my favorite, favorite character sticker from her, her and Kisma. And so I had to get those. These ones are beautiful overlay stickers that I'm going to find a home for. And I just love these things. There's Boo, I Put a Spell on You from Hocus Pocus, Drink Up Witches, <laughs> which is awesome, Trick or Treat Y'all. And then, so I got that in silver. I also got one in rose gold. And this one is only Hocus Pocus because I love that movie so much. So I definitely feel like it needed its own sheet. Um, it's got some very classic sayings. Come we fly. Amuck, amuck, amuck. I love the black flame candle. And oh look, another glorious morning. Makes me sick. So these are beautiful as well. And this is in the rose gold. I also had a gold one that came previously. And that one I used already in my Thanksgiving spread. So I got a silver one, rose gold, and a gold one. And this one says, candy apple cutie, <laughs> too cute to spook, sweeter than pumpkin pie. And then this one had a uh, cutest pumpkin in the patch, which I used in my pumpkin patch spread earlier this month. So those are those ones. Um, and then these are just kind of like, I said, like my miscellaneous fall ones that I'm going to work into other spreads. They are single stickers. They are kind of a la carte. So you just pick them. They don't really belong to anything. And uh, so this is just some fall leaves that I'm going to be using, which is beautiful, especially in Canada. We do have a lot of really nice maple trees in our area. And I love, love, love the way they turn colors in the fall. And I have, of course, Casper, which is one of the kids' favorite Halloween movies, as well as Hocus Pocus. We also like Beetlejuice. Um, just trying to find the other. Oh, this is the Casper Mansion. We also like Ghostbusters, Nightmare Before Christmas. Such a fun holiday. These are the actual Sanderson sisters, these are the Hocus Pocus witches. So we have Mary, Winifred, and Sarah. And these are absolutely gorgeous. I'm actually going to be using this one for my Disney Villains kit because it was a Disney movie. And I, I didn't have as many weeks as I wanted to to use everything. Like, ideally, like I could have do like all four weeks of October and Halloween because that's how much I love it and there's just so many beautiful sticker kits and stuff it's so hard to choose but I had I like to do this fall kit it's my dad's birthday also next week so I'm gonna be doing something for him and um, I like to just honor his birthday with like his own theme and not get Halloween in there and then um, Halloween that only leaves me really like two weeks so it was really hard to decide but I don't know if you guys remember from last time, I did the Disney Villains. Um, the Disney Villains kit is going to be one of them. And so I'm going to be adding these to this because it is also Disney. And um, that is what I'm going to be doing for this kit. And then, oh, this is the Kisma, the other character that I like. And she's doing like, a tarot reading or is it tarot cards I never know how to pronounce it if you guys know let me know in the bottom 
uh, below. So she's just doing like a little reading here, which I thought was super cute. And I love, love, love vampires. I was a huge Buffy fan when I was a little girl. I actually got to meet Spike at one of our fan expos. And I have that picture somewhere and his autograph. Um, I think it's downstairs in the basement. I have like a little Buffy shrine. <laughs> Um, and then I also loved Vampire Diaries and all those things. So definitely had to include some vampire-ish themed uh, stickers to my Halloween weeks. Also loved Dracula, like all like supernatural like stories, shows. I'm a huge, huge, huge fan all year round of, uh, for those, not just in Halloween. I love this one here as well, this ghost. I'm actually not sure where this one is from, but I really, really, really love it. So I decided to get it as well. And then, so those are like more of the Halloween stickers. And then these are more like fall. I got these to do, just to add, just to have. I, I, I kind of ordered some of these each order that I do. Um, usually order one or two. Just to kind of have throughout the season to add to kits that maybe don't have the glitter headers that I want to add to. Um, so for fall, I've gotten like three or four of these different kind of browns and rose golds and golds just to kind of fill up the kit a little bit more because I love, love glitter and need to have it in every single kit. So if it doesn't have it, I will include it and find a way. I love these fall girls as well. So I'm going to look at getting these in somewhere. So gorgeous. I love white pants. Whoever said you can't wear white after Labor Day was like seriously missing out because I just, I don't know. I've never understood that rule. I think white looks gorgeous all year round, um, but especially with this these colors. Oh, gorgeous. And then I also got these stickers, which are just like super fall vibes and I could not resist. We have a dog. I love reading. We've been doing lots of baking. I love like sweater, jeans, and booties. It's like what I wear like every day. Oh, such a, st a fall staple. I love this beautiful bed with the lights, pumpkin spice lattes, got the leaves candle, which is actually one of her favorite candles of all time. I've been watching her for years and she always used to mention these in her videos. So I think it's really cool that she included this as well. It's kind of a personal touch. And then this kind of like old recording machine. Um, we actually have one at the cottage, um, which is really awesome. And we have some old like uh, LPs, I guess. Well, I forget what they're called, but we have some of these there and we listen to it. And there's just something super special about listening to music on an old uh, recorder. I don't even know what the name is. It's It's been a while. <laughs> but uh, so when I just, I just see this, it just, it just gives me like special memories, like going off to the cottage and stuff like that during fall. So I really wanted to include that. And then these ones were just kind of like a splurge by. <laughs> they are super cute. Um, and I just kind of like how she kind of tied in like mean girls into this. So it's like get in loser. We're going trick or treating, which is adorable. I love mean girls as well. And I have some stuff kind of related to that. I'll show you soon as well. I just, I just really like this one. This one was just like a super hello, happy Halloween vibe and just so much fun. And I just love it. Also got like our favorite movies here. Hocus Pocus, Haunted Mansion, Halloween Town, Beetlejuice, The Witches, Don't Look Under the Bed, Adam's Family. Oh, this, this is another one. Um, that's big in our house, Nightmare Before Christmas, Halloween Town, Scream, and Casper. Super cute. So I'm going to be using this in my um, petite planner for sure. So that is what all that I got from Glam Planner. I'm just going to like throw these back in here quickly just so I don't lose any stickers while I'm doing this. Um going to jump ahead or kind of out of the stickers for a second and just because we were just talking about Mean Girls, I just wanted to take a second to show you guys this beautiful sticker book that I got from Cricut Paper Co. And instead of burn book, it says sticker book. How like awesome is this? I was so excited when I saw this. I could not put this in my cart fast enough. Oh, so great. I cannot wait to use this. 
um, for like my leftover stickers and like that sort of thing. This is going to be really awesome. And then this one pretty much speaks for itself. <laughs> it says organized AF, and I'm pretty sure you guys all know what that means. So I'm not going to say that on here because I'll get in trouble, but I just thought this was awesome because I do <laughs> say this a lot of the time. So to have this on a sticker book is just <laughs> hilarious. My husband thought this was really funny as well. So I got these. I also got some new pens from Shop to Be Love Beautiful. I feel like my haul videos are not complete without her pens. <laughs> I wanted to get, there's like this beautiful blood red one, but I wasn't able to get that one. So I did settle on, I shouldn't say settle. They're all really beautiful in their own way. But this one is like, it's like a raspberry Merlot color. It just reminds me of like fall colors, wine, like just beautiful like maroons and the sparkles on it are really pretty. I also got black for Halloween, of course, which is also gorgeous. Look at that sparkle. So beautiful. And then this one is just like a slate gray kind of. It's a matte, which is different from her other colors. Her other colors, like the caps, I don't know if you can see, they're like more shiny. But this one's like a matte, which I actually really like. Um, and then the coloring in here, the sparkles are so pretty. Look at that gorgeous, oh. I love these so much and like you can see that there we go finally I get this thing to focus never focuses when I want it to and then like randomly it will just decide to work so anyway so I got three new pens for fall which I have been using and loving as well back to the sticker that I got is from um I think the aesthetic Studio. Yes, this is Aesthetic Studio. She does some really beautiful stickers as well. I have featured her in um, another video or two in the past. And I just, I love, it's in the name, I guess, the aesthetic, but I love the aesthetic, like the design, like the way she designs her stickers. I love the look of them. Um, and I just love everything she included here. Some autumn tails, like there's some tea, acorns, um, pumpkin pie, some pumpkins, including a white one, which I absolutely love and I think it's so beautiful. So I got some of these as well. And then this one is called uh, Dark Academia, which I also like. I like the style of like this kind of stuff as well. I actually used to have a typewriter when I was a little girl. That's actually where I first learned how to like type my homeroom keys. How much am I aging myself right now? But my mom kept hers and then she used to make us, cause she used to be like addicted to typist. So she used to do typing for a living like back in the day um, for the Montreal Gazette actually. And um, so she actually gave us her or lent us, like let us use her old typewriter when we first started learning our homeroom keys. Then eventually moved on to computers. Yes, not everybody was born with computers, guys. <laughs> I am such a dinosaur, but I'm slowly catching up to the times. How am I doing? I hope I'm doing okay. <laughs> I love this tea. My mom has some really beautiful tea sets, so it reminds me of that. And there's a locket and some Polaroid uh, photos that we have, and I also really like. So this one just kind of reminds me of like the olden days, which, you know, is kind of nostalgic for me. Has a special place in my heart. This one is tea time, which I guess could be any time of year, but I really just really drink like the most tea, I guess, in the fall. Um, she's got some fall leaves and stuff here, but also some spring ones. And there's like little donuts and like little pastries and stuff, which I also really love and should not eat as many, <laughs> especially now I've been trying to uh, lose weight. I've lost almost 10 pounds since I started uh, in September, and my goal is to lose about 20 to 25 by the end of this year. So halfway there, woo, I'm so excited. 
and I'm definitely feeling much better. I have more energy. I'm feeling more confident. Fitting into everything a little bit easier. <laughs> First three months of COVID were like, oh, I got like that COVID-19 and I'm just trying to get rid of it. So almost there. And then this one is like a different version of Happy Mail, um, which I really like. Again, reminds me very vintage, very retro. Love those vibes. And I used to be huge. I shouldn't even say used to be. Even up until last year, every year I still would be mailing my Christmas cards with COVID and stuff and just germs and the mail and all that stuff. I'm not going to be sending them this year. We're going to be doing like e-cards and like a couple of different things. But I just love the way Christmas cards and, you know, birthday cards and that look on the mantle. It's how we always had them growing up and something that I still like the look of to this day. This reminds me of like a little bit like home. And um, one of the last shops that I ordered from was um, Nani's Custom Creations. Oh, there's still some things in here. And she does some really beautiful clips and planner bands as well, which I've just discovered and I absolutely love. I have so many of her clips already. Like, it's crazy how many I have, but I, I use them for all occasions and I just love them. Oh, look how gorgeous that is. This is a beautiful hollow. Camera isn't even doing it justice, but it says, which please, which I think is hilarious. And then <laughs> got this little cute witch hat, which is super cute as well. And then she also had it in a planner band, so I, I kind of had to get it. <laughs> so she has it in a planner band, and she also has Mom Life, which I love because I am a mom, so I definitely had to get this one. Uh, girl Boss, which is like positive girl vibes. I also love like women empowering women. I think that's amazing. And so many of you guys, well, ladies, are very good at doing this in the planner community. I say guys as well because there are some really talented guys out there as well who I'm also following and think is just incredible. And then this one really helps me, especially with my anxiety. It's something that basically is my mantra, keep calm and plan on. And this is something I need to remind myself every day, just keep calm, keep planning, keep going, and everything will be okay. So I got these. And I have some pictures of these and how they look on my planner on Instagram. I would show them here, but the easy covers are so reflective. And whenever I try to show them with this camera, it just ends up like you can't really see anything. So um, if anything, you know what, I'll just include a picture here. So she gets my attention she will literally just come and just sit right in my filming space and be like play with me mama I'm almost done <laughs> if you guys don't mind Harley here <laughs> um, I just want to quickly show you the planner band now that there's not quite as much glare here um, so once you kind of it does come off so it doesn't like stick to your planner in a way where like I'm worried that it's gonna like pull any of this or not come off but it's just like a little, it just holds it basically. So when you do try to move it, like you can see here, it kind of stays in place and you can just be rest assured that everything is going to be held in nicely and the pen's not gonna come off and you're not going to lose it. So definitely recommend these. So that's what that, uh, that one looks like. That's also my new planner cover for Halloween. So I thought that these looked really good together. I love, love, love these. She also has a couple other designs. The quality is amazing. Also, here, I'm going to open one. I was I'm really impressed as well because, like, so it, the backing of them actually has, like, a, like a no no slip grip so basically when this is on your planner it it like stays on it doesn't move around this backing like whatever material she uses here actually makes this like almost stick to your planner cover so it, like you get a nice tight good fit um and you know you can be really confident that everything's going to be hold, held together and not come off and you won't lose it so definitely love that as well her stuff is not only beautiful but very high quality too and she's been really sweet. 
So that is that. Um, these are not really from like traditional shop, but I thought that I would show them anyway. So these are a couple of things that I got from the dollar store because they are amazing. And I just love their stuff so much. So I got some pens, because I, or sorry, pencils, because even though I'm a huge pen fan, I also like to use pencils as well. Um, I use these just like for like scrap notes and stuff. I like to have these like by my desk or by the phone, like just around the house. So I thought that these were kind of cute to use for this time of year. So I got a couple of pencils. Also got some for the kids as well. <laughs> um, and then I got these cute stickers for like emotions. Um, so like where I would normally use like lolly and pop, I just thought I could use these for my Halloween week. So like, you know, oh, like if I'm having a long day, like a, no, if I'm angry, just feeling goofy. And then these ones are actually called like emotion stickers. So I don't know. I just saw these. I thought these were so cute and I had to get them. I got the little ghosts and then I also got them in little vampire. Cause like I said before, I love vampires. So like little hard. Yay. If you're having a good day, <laughs> you're just not feeling it. I win. Oh my God. Or OMG. Again. <laughs> Oh, so cute. Oh, and he's crying too. I didn't even hardly see that one before. So I just thought these were really fun. Um, and I thought for like my Halloween week that I would use these instead of Lolly and Pop. And then this one, I don't know if you guys remember in the summer, I kind of had like uh, a similar, like I used some rhinestones in the summer for our wedding kit. So... <laughs> This is what we did. So I didn't write in this spread. I actually decided not to, um, just because it was it was it was so pretty, <laughs> and I have like the worst writing. And I I just didn't want to like I don't know. I just didn't want to touch it with anything. I just wanted to leave it like this. It's kind of like a memory spread, um, just kind of just beautiful the way it was. Like I I don't know. I just couldn't write in this week. So, but this is the kind of like. Um, like this kind of rhinestone sticker that I ended up using for this, for that special week that we did for our wedding anniversary. And then, so I'm thinking of doing a similar thing with these guys, which are like orange and purple, which are probably my favorite Halloween colors ever. And I'm thinking of using these ones with my Halloween kit. This one here. Um, which is going to be Nightmare Before Christmas, of course. So I'm going to be doing the Disney villain one for one week, and I'm going to be doing this one for the second week. And I just thought, like, how cute would this look, like, with this? I don't know. I'm going to try it and see, but I think it's going to look really awesome. And then I also got, I don't know if I showed you guys this the last time or not, but I also am going to be trying... Um, some like dark washi and like stickers which I've never tried before this is the first time I've ever got like a black kind of like a dark sticker kit and I thought that this would look good for like because it's such a colorful kit I thought this would be awesome to use like Monday Tuesday Wednesday Thursday Friday and I just feel like this kit's just going to be very colorful and very fun so this would just add to that vibe and like I said, even though we can't go trick-or-treating, there's no reason why we still can't have fun for Halloween this year. I think it's important. So this is going to go with these, and that's what I'm going to use. I will be posting... Actually, you know what? I might do this one as a video as my next plan with me, so you guys can kind of see how I do that. So look for that. That's probably going to be my video for next week, um, and you guys can see how I plan and mix this all together and how it turns out. Because I haven't done a plan with me in a little while, so... Let's do that. I will do that next week. Um, the other thing that I got are some Wonder Woman covers. And I also got this beautiful notebook that I haven't used yet. But it's so beautiful. So I can't wait to use it. I'm just finishing off my Hello Kitty one <laughs> that was also that was released kind of in the end of the summer. So I got this one just a couple weeks ago, um, which I ordered because... The, Wonder, the new Wonder Woman movie was supposed to come out, I think it was like October 4th, 
but sadly, obviously because of COVID, yet another thing was delayed, but hopefully it comes out soon and hopefully we can see it because I absolutely love her. Um, I also got two covers for this collection as well, which I will show a picture of here. Just find the pictures easier for the covers because they are very glary and hard to see. And I also got this guy. I know it's not really planning related, but I don't know. It's just so much glitter and it just made me so happy. So I just thought I would share this with you guys as well. Again, this is from Dollarama. It's just, oh, I love the black and I love the silver. It is so pretty. And I'm obsessed with glitter, so when I saw this, I just had to get it. So I'll show you what I'm going to be doing for the kids. If any of you guys are, I don't know what you guys are, are doing, but I got two of these. So I got like a green, uh, sorry, purple bucket, which my son loves. That's his favorite color. And I also got a green bucket. And then what I'm going to be doing is I'm just going to be like filling it up with some um, Halloween-inspired goodies. So I got like some festive sticker packs um, or like sorry uh, playing play packs like little sticker albums some spooky Halloween stickers for them and they will likely be getting whichever ones of these that I don't use as well um, so I got them like some stickers a little play pack um, like some little Halloween rings which they love like little, just like a bunch of these like little like grab bag type things. So I don't have everything yet, but I mean, this is just kind of some of the things that I get, I got from them. And then also, of course, they're each going to be getting their own pencils, um, Halloween pencils as well. And then I got these cute little bats. I got a pink one for my daughter and the blue one, I don't know where, and I got a blue one for my son. I think that one's downstairs. So I got this like little, you should get them like a little teddy every year, like a cute little festive, like socky or something cute. So I got her one of those. And then we're also going to be doing some cupcakes because we love baking. That's how I ended up with my COVID-19 pounds in the first place. <laughs> but I figure as long as it's in moderation, plus I'm working now, so definitely going to be working it off because I'm working long hours. Um, so I got some cupcakes uh, to be making. And then we also got some candy. So we're going to be like putting some candy in there as well. Or like I said, we might just actually take it and like hide it around the yard and do like almost like kind of an Easter type style of like scavenger hunt where they can just kind of go around the yard and we can just decorate it. Um, and they can kind of have fun that way. So... That's pretty much it. That's all that I got for fall. I hope you guys liked this haul. I hope you didn't mind a little bit about the kids at the end. Um, but they are a big part of my life. And that is a lot of the stuff that I ended up getting as well. Thank you so much for your support, guys. I really appreciate it. You guys are the best. Um, don't forget to hit subscribe so you don't miss any of my notifications or my new videos and don't forget to hit like if you like this as well um as i said next week i'm going to be doing a plan with me for this halloween kit and um or sorry not next week it'll be the week after that whatever week halloween falls on i think it'll be like the 31st of the first i'm going to be doing a plan with me like a halloween kit Next week, I'm not really sure what I'm going to be doing yet, so stay tuned. <laughs> but uh, I'm sure that it's going to be fun. And yeah, hopefully you guys enjoy your weekend and you guys have been enjoying your fall so far and your Thanksgiving for those of my Canadian followers. And continuing to stay healthy and safe as always. Thank you so much again and look forward to seeing you next week. Bye, guys.